The Z820 is HP's top-of-the-line workstation, built to achieve the highest levels of performance for demanding environments such as high-end production and post. It's appointed with rugged brushed metal sides, one of which is removable by simply lifting a handle near the top. The Z820 also embodies HP's principle of tool-less serviceability and upgrading. To get to the internal components, you'll need to remove a couple of airflow covers. The bottom one grants access to the PCIe slots. The other cover contains several fans which are used to cool the system. Removing it exposes the system's CPUs and RAM slots. For the CPUs, this Z820 contained two Intel Sandy Bridge Xeon E52687 8-core processors. That's an impressive 16 combined total physical cores and 32 virtual cores. The new E5 Xeons also fully support third-generation PCI Express technology, as well as permit you to install an astonishing 512 gigabytes of memory in the Z820. With all that power, it's important to keep things running as cool as possible. Thus, the processors in the Z820 are liquid-cooled. The Z820 also contained a powerful NVIDIA Quadro 6000 PCIe GPU. This PCIe graphics card features 6 gigabytes of memory and 448 CUDA cores. It allows for outstanding performance in 3D animation applications from companies such as Autodesk and Maxon. It also greatly accelerates Adobe's Mercury Playback Engine. Inserting and removing drives is as simple as pulling them out of the accessible hard drive bay. This machine came with three 300 gigabyte SATA SSDs. The first contained the operating system, and the other two were configured into a 600 gigabyte SSD RAID. On the front of the machine, there's two fast USB 3.0 ports, 10 times faster than USB 2.0. There's also a USB 2.0 port, a Firewire port, and a headphone and mic jack. The back of the machine includes two more USB 3.0 ports, four USB 2.0 ports, two Ethernet ports, a Firewire port, and common audio jacks. The Z820 performed very impressively on Maxon's Cinebench benchmarking application. On the GPU test, which measures real-time rendering, it received a score of 87.78. On the CPU test, which measures how long it takes to calculate complex rendering challenges and multiple lighting effects, it scored 25.41. Here's a comparison of Cinebench scores between the HP Z820, its predecessor the Z800, and a 12-core Mac Pro. The Z820 is a supremely powerful machine, and it was difficult to find any other workstation that approached its power and performance. That's why we're giving it an NYCPP Editor's Choice Award for its design and outstanding performance.